Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. And in this video, I'm going to tell you some news about the changes to Titan cost in the update 8.3. Before we start, please give a like to this video and consider subscribe to my channel. Okay, let's have a look at these changes. So the Pixonic just published a community update on the Reddit. It's about the changes to Titan cost in the coming update 8.3. And here's the main detail for this update. Uh, it says we adjust the cost of acquiring and upgrading Titan equipment. That means you spend less platinum to buy Titan and their weapons and modules in the shop. And it also costs less platinum to upgrade these stuffs. And the second one is we also redistribute them across tiers and that means they gonna divide into uh, different tiers some will change, some will move up, some will move down I think and the final one is most titans and titan equipment pieces will become significantly cheaper some weapons will become more expensive to upgrade and there's some good news and some bad news, right? Um, here's the context. I'm gonna, I'm not gonna read that all. And feel free to stop the video to have a look if you're interested. And let's go down to here's the detail about the change. What will change? It's mainly the change to acquire and upgrade the Titan stuff. And we look at the chart. It's it's more direct. It's more easy to understand, right? So here's the tier one. Tier one, we have the kit, we have the machine guns, vengeance, and retaliator, and titan armor kit, and singular reactor. So the item cost no change for the kit because it's free, right? No change. But the full upgrade cost is down by 70%. It's reduced by 70%. There's a great reduce in the platinum required to upgrade the kit to the max level. It now only costs 3060 platinum to get the kit to the max level. So that's a good, very good news to the new players or even those free to play players. And because most of them, they are going to use the kit. But some of them, they not enough at having the kit, they might move up to have some stuff in the tier 2 and in the tier 2 we have the Alming and Arthur an item cost to get these two titans uh, 400 and 500 I think the 400 is for the Arthur and the 500 is for the Alming right, the Alming is reduced by 30% and the Alpha is still the same price if you want to buy them in a shop. But the upgrade cost are both reduced by 40% for these two Titans. Only 6,130 platinum to upgrade them to max. And it even costs less uh, during those Titan discount events, right? Uh, another 25% I think is only... 4,600 platinum, around, around that much to get these two titans to max level and for the weapons, we have the Gendam, the Sar, the Kurasir and the Raptor they all cost less to acquire in the shop only 300 platinum you can buy one of those in the shop and they both reduce 40% from 40% to 60% that's a good news to some of the low level players and the cost to upgrade them also reduced by 20% and the modules, these two modules and only 200 platinum to buy them in the shop and the cost to upgrade them is reduced by 30% and now we move up to the T3 Tier 3, we have Minos, Nodens, Sharanga, and Murumets. I'm surprised Murumets is only at Tier 3. It's probably 
uh, because they are getting a nerf in upcoming up, uh, updates, maybe. And the cost to acquire these titans is just reduced. I think there's not reduce, not any reduce in the cost to buy them in a shop. It costs one thousand platinum, but the full upgrade cost is reduced by ten percent. Though it's only nine thousand and two hundred platinum to get these titans to max level and for the weapons it has cyclone cataclysm kisten cinder crate striker squall brom basilisk and bulava these are all reduced by 40 percent to buy them in the shop but the upgrade cost is no changes and come down to the module, it has the accelerator, the self-fix unit, and a quantum sensor. The price for them is 300 platinum. Uh, the price reduced by 25% and 50%. The cost to upgrade them to full the max level is reduced by 10%. It's a good news, it's a good news to all players. And now is the tier 4. Tier 4 is the Luchador, the Hamdout, and the upcoming Indra, the new Titan in the update 8.3. So the price to get them is unchanged. So you, you cannot get them in the shop at the moment, I think. You need to uh, get them in the event chest. So the fully upgrade cost will not change for these three Titans. And the weapon in the tier 4 has the Desra, the Gargantua, the Waja, Lantern, Pentagrew, the Maha Waja, those two new energy shotguns, Titan shotguns. So the upgrade cost for this weapon is in increased. It's increased by 30%. Alright, that's the bad news. That's bad news. Even though not many players would like to upgrade the Destra and Lantern and maybe the Gargantua even now and in the update 8.3 because they're getting a nerf in the update 8.3. Right? Uh, so it is a, it's up to the players to upgrade uh, upgrade these weapons or not. If some players are still interested in using this weapons like Destra and Gargantua they may probably upgrade now because in the update 8.3 it's gonna increase by 30% you're gonna cost you're gonna spend a lot more platinum to get these weapons to max out and for the modules we have the damage controller the onslaught reactor titan and control cannibal reactor they are all unchanged. Alright, so no need to worry about this. So here's what does it mean. The blah blah blah, a lot of things. And another good news is that they, they will have more platinum in the supply center. But how much more, we don't know. Uh, I don't think we should expect too much platinum in the supply center, right? And it says the change will go online with update 8.3 and we plan to release it no earlier than August 8th. So the update and the change will arrive after the 8th of August. Alright, uh, they still have some time. So if you are planning to upgrade the titan stuff you can uh, have a close look at these changes and make a good plan it will save you a lot of platinum and help you progress the game faster all right okay that's it and thank you for watching the video and please consider subscribe uh, see you in the next video bye bye